Welcome to another somewhat explanation slash theory video. If you're new to my channel or don't know much about the BTS storyline, check out my summary video of the Pangtan universe. Link is in my description box. Sup? Um, so... <laughs> Hacker from the future here. I'm back again talking about Amino. So I have an exclusive series on Amino that's been ongoing. We are finally at the last episode. I can't believe time has flown. But if you guys are interested, it is called the BTS Universe. And in the series, I actually go over Easter eggs and theories I've never talked about before on this channel. And it's only exclusive to Amino, but don't worry, it's easy to access. Just click on the link in my description box to download Amino. Go to Discover, click on Amino Originals Topic, and you'll see different amazing series. Find me there with my series called BTS Universe. You could also search me up by my username, Excelest. Make sure to follow me and stay updated with all my episodes. Just watch all my six episodes. And actually, let me know down in the comment section of my final video which episode was your favorite. Let me know. Okay, I'm gonna go now, okay? Bye! Big Hit created collectible figurines and the preview teaser got some people talking. These collectibles are based off of characters from the Punktan universe and for the first time, they showed the whole body of the mysterious creature. What exactly is this? A lot of people have made theories as to what it could be. Some say it's a magical fox, while others say it's a cat, and then, you know, there's a dog. So there was a white animal that was revealed in the BU, and it was a white puppy. This white puppy first appears in Taehyung's Stigma film. In the Notes 1 book, June 7, year 20, Taehyung was searching for a two-month-old puppy named Tobu which means tofu in Korean. The book also had pictures and one of them was a missing dog flyer. Fluffy tail, folded ears, white puppy. Now during the Save Me webtoon, a white fluffy creature appears. They never revealed the full body until now. And guess what? It's a cat. At least that's what it says on their product details. So for sure we know it's a cat now. So far, we don't know much about this though, except that it plays a role with Sokjin's character. This creature could be the guide that helps him travel in time. We don't know whether the cat gave him the ability to time travel, or maybe Sokjin already had this ability and it was passed down by his father. Now, there's other theories I want to talk about, such as my theory about BTS and TXT being under the same universe, similar to the Marvel Universe or Star Wars Universe. Now, when we think about the cat, people have actually brought up the ending scene for TXT's cat and dog music video. At the end, it shows a scene of footprints in a sand by the ocean. Similar to the scene from BTS's Save Me webtoon when Sokjin first encountered the cat. Not only that, am I rhyming or something? I'm sorry. But if you look closely to the toy cat, you'll notice that it has blue and green eyes. Just like the cat from TXT's Nap of the Star. Now, is this a coincidence? I don't know. We're talking about Big Hit here, okay? Of course, that's not the only connection and more keeps coming out. But there is a character named Choi in the Pangtan Universe notes. And TXT actually has three members with the last name Choi. So far, we still don't know much about this creature and where it came from, but eventually they'll reveal more of it. But now we are moving on to the other figurines. I'll be talking about the characters and the connection they have with each item. Now, I do want to point out that some of their temporary happiness items have been changed in order to be more suitable as a toy. What I mean by temporary items is for example, during the fake love teaser, you see them trading in their fears and regrets for a positive attitude. Later, we find out those positive items don't last forever. J-Hope and his cake. The cake represents the time his friend gave him a cake and he's known her for more than 10 years now in this universe. Yoongi and his lighter, which was originally a yellow lollipop. The lighter represents the guitar girl he's been working with. She was the one who wrote his initials YK. And the yellow lollipop would have been too small as a toy. So I see why they exchanged it. But the guitar girl switched out Yoongi's cigarette 
to a lollipop in order to stop him from smoking. Jungkook and his sketchbook, which was originally a key. The sketchbook represents a time he was outside with the girl he met at the hospital. And during the fake love teaser, he originally got a key. And the theory behind it is that it was a key to unlock a room. And the room had robes and masks, which represents them hiding their true selves under a mask. <laughs> Jimin and his umbrella. Now, they haven't fully explained the positive impact behind the umbrella other than the fact that it covers him from the rain. And when Jimin was young, it started to rain after a school picnic, so he tried to take cover at the flowering abortorium and that's when he witnessed an incident that scarred him for life. Taehyung and the spray can, which was originally a backpack. The spray can represents his love for graffiti, which he would always get in trouble for by the cops. The backpack with the red bandana represents the girl he met at the convenience store. Namjoon and his blue book that was originally a hair tie. And again, a hair tie would be too small as a toy, so it makes sense. The blue book represents the library he always goes to. Well, that's my theory behind it, but he's been riding the same bus and going to the same library as the girl for about a month now, and they've never spoken, but he wanted to give her the hair tie. Then there's Sokjin with his smeraldo flowers, which represents the girl he fell in love with. He first saw her when she dropped her diary, I, or at least we think that's the first time he saw her, but in that diary, he found things she liked, and one of them included the smeraldo flowers which he eventually got for her. So yes, this is basically a quick explanation video about the toys that were released and the items. As far as the cat, it's still a big mystery, but let me know in the comment section what your theories are behind this creature. I hope you enjoyed this video though. If you did, make sure to click that like button and also join the Flare Squad by subscribing, you guys. Thanks for watching.